Matt Games in the building. What's going on, YouTube? Today, I got another video from our Ultimate Team people out there, bro. So, if I was starting Ultimate Team right now, today, what would I be doing? Fresh new team. This is what I'll be doing right now, man. You know how to play Madden. You locked in. I will get right into this draft event and start working on getting my five, five and O's. I know I'm not that good. I'm not this. I'm not that, bro. Get up in here. Play some regular Madden. Hell, making it to four games, three games. Build up on that fear, as you can see in the top of my screen right there, the thing all the way to the left. Build up on that fear. Because that fear, I got that amount saved and I got my five and O's five times. I was able to give me a Carlton Davis, sell him for about 800K. And then once I got to the end of those five and O's, I got this pack right here. I chose weeks one through three, meaning I'm going to be able to choose any 90 overall champion. And I think that Brock Purdy is in there as well. I'm going to be able to choose between those to either sell or have on the team, as well as I got all that fear saved up. So. I can go to the fear store right here. This one right here for 47,595. Sellable. You're able to choose. I'm waiting until the last drop. You're able to choose between all of them. And then another B and D version of them. Now, for me, I'm not selling any of those cards. I'm in the process of making me a Packers, Patriots, Commanders theme team. So I'm gonna be utilizing those, all of those on Randy Moss, Darrell Revis, and Trent Williams. Trent Williams is on the way, in case you guys didn't know. So I'm going to be utilizing my three on those cards right there. Then with the extra leftover, that was something that reset. I want to say it was the spooky, not spooky. It was another one. I want to say it was about 5,000. I want to say it was about 5,000. Could it have been this? It wasn't this. But it was one for about 5,000. I rode about 20,000 training into that. That I should, well, at least I'm going to try to have that much left over to do that. And then we do that as well. And while you're in the process of doing that, you also going to be ranking up this most fear pass. And with this most fear pass, you also get fear. This one of the best users in the game you use fear to upgrade. Him. Not that much about what well, about 20, 15, 20,000 fear to upgrade him. As you play in this game, you're knocking out challenges. You leveling up here as well. Matter of fact, I didn't even talk about challenges, but as you see, boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm saying? Doing your thing. And you want to make sure that you are on top of your most feared challenges. Now, me saying that, I need to lock in and knock out my most feared challenges as well. Because there's definitely some cards your boy got to pick up and be locked in, ready to pick up indeed. So, stay on top of those challenges. As you can see, when you go through those challenges, you get upgrade tokens for your Taysom Hill or your Ndamukong Su. What's that? We finna get into that. But as you can see, just press triangle on them. I like that I added this in. You see all the things that you get in the process of upgrading these. Matter of fact, I am I'm on top of these. I was just doing it to get my Taysom or Dominican Supac. So basically, we got a Taysom Hill who could play every position on offense. Well, not every position, no offensive line, but he could play tight end, wide receiver, running back, quarterback. I chose the wide receiver uh, so I couldn't have him. He's going to be on all theme teams. As you can see, I'm going to show you guys this card right now. Go into the catalog. We go program, most fear. Yee. Yeah. Program, most fear. Uh, team, I probably do Saints, right? He probably pop up. I do Saints, definitely pop up. I do Saints. Boom, taste him as you can see quarterback, running back, tight end, wide receiver. I chose the wide receiver one, but all you could choose one of any one of them. You choose one of any one of them, as you can see. Once I max them out, once you max them out, you get all team cams. He's gonna be stock 89 speed, so he's gonna be 90 speed on the theme team. You get all of those cams on him, you know what I'm saying. And then, you know, you got these. They, nothing gives a speed boost. I think something boosts height or something like that, but I'm pretty sure that joint going away. But you can choose any one of those, or you can go the other route and choose the mystery player. The mystery player is Indomitian Sue. And Indomitian Sue can play cornerback, defensive tackle. What was it? Corner, defensive tackle, and middle linebacker. Now, I would advise not getting the middle linebacker. Nobody really knows them. But the D tackle got 86 speed, solid, and the cornerback. This is what most people get in getting the corner. I haven't chosen yet because I want to see what cards I get in the process of this week. But I, I haven't chosen anything yet. But as you can see, 89 speed maxed out. He's 6'4. A tree fitty. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, all theme teams there. So you get to choose. It's nothing special you got to do for those log in, do challenges, upgrade pass to get the upgrade tokens. You're able to choose one unless you was playing from the very beginning and you was able to choose yourself a Taysom and one of these Indomitian suits. But I don't think you're going to be able to max them both out. Which sucks. But is what it is and then another thing that i'm gonna be doing 
you guys have been playing. You got yourself a team. Look, I know you might not want to hear this, but get your ass in head to head right now, bro. And get to hero. You know what I'm saying? I started off amazing, ended horribly. It took me 28 because I went on a nasty losing streak on stream. It's like I ran into the sweatiest of sweats or it just won my day. Either way, boy was getting his ass whooped. Three days, 29 minutes from the time I'm recording this to get to Hero. Hero realistically could take you about eight hours. Like it, or if you're just going on a nice little winning spree, it ain't even gonna take you that long to get to Hero. Why do I want to get to Hero? Well, if you get to Hero, you probably gonna get yourself arguably the best wide receiver in the game as a ranked reward. Because if you go to ranked right here, um, this is who you get if you're in the top 100 of that. You ain't getting there if you just now start. That's who you get if you get the champion. Nobody wants the Neil Hunter, but Jalen Hyatt is who you get. And as you can see, six feet tall, 92 speed, 89 short route running, 90 medium route running, 92 deep route running, really good acceleration at 91. And he will have all theme teams. He also going to have slot apprentice. You know what I'm saying? Outside apprentice. He's going to cook up for a lot of people. So you want to make sure you are locked in into getting that card as well. You know what I'm saying? You can, you can, it's a lower version that you could get. You know what I'm saying? The 89 version, you just was going to make it to Elite. A hey, 90 speed. 90 speed. Only Giants can. Just something else that I would definitely be doing locked in. And that is about it. If I was to be starting out some team right now, I would lock in to get my draft done and possibly, if I can, make it to that hero rank. Knock out all your most fear solos. Just take advantage of this most fear promo because... It's at a high right now, and man, we got we got some stuff dropping, bro. Make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe, and let me know what what season level y'all at, bro. Cause I'm at 26, and I think I'm slack.